Hello friends, in this video we will discuss about one classic ECG pattern known as electrical alternance. We will also discuss causes and how to approach when you get these ECG changes. Do watch full video for better understanding. First of all, what is electrical alternance? How to define it? It is defined as alternating amplitude of QRS complex that is seen in all leads with no additional changes to the conduction pathways of the heart. Let me explain you with the help of example. As you can see in this ECG, the amplitude of QRS complex varies beat to beat and this pattern is known as electrical alternance. Note that there is no disturbance in rhythm, rhythm is regular. Then coming to etiology, electrical alternance is most commonly attributed to pericardial effusion or cardiac tamponade. This classic ECG pattern is due to anterior posterior swinging of the heart with each contraction in the fluid field pericardial sac. As the heart swings, the electrical signals detected by electrodes travel over a varying distance, resulting in varying voltage. Even though electrical alternance is considered as pathonomic for pericardial effusion, but it is not diagnostic because many other pathologies can result in these ECG changes. Now when you come across the electrical alternance pattern on ECG, the further revolution is needed to find the cause. If patient is stable, transthoracic echo is done considering pericardial effusion. And if patient is unstable, Bedside echo is considered to rule out cardiac tamponade. The definitive treatment of tamponade is pericardiosynthesis. And after stabilizing the patient, other investigations are done to rule out the cause. So guys, this was all about this video. I hope you liked the content. Do like, share and subscribe our channel and also share it among your friends. Thank you.